Hey, this is Todd Sloggett from The Saving Place, rustic furniture and mattress store in downtown Sepulpa, Oklahoma. We actually have the deepest line of rustic furniture in the entire state. Great prices, all kinds of product. We're actually controlled by a mission group. We're generating money for to help the homeless and drug addicts and, and uh, different ministry groups all the time. And uh, we, we carry real wood, solid wood, cheaper than most of the modern veneers you can get your hands on. Uh, it's, it's western, it's country, it's farm, it's cowboy. That's kind of our specialty. And as you look around and see some of the product, you'll see we've got, got some real leather. We've got some real Brazilian longhorn cowhide. And uh, you can see us at 619 East Dewey Avenue, downtown Sepulpa, Oklahoma. Call us at 918-227-4673 or visit our website, thesavingplace.net. Okay, so we have a little dilemma here at the Keeping It Dutch household. We are an up, we're, we're an up in arms over a game of jacks. It's getting yeah. serious in here, yeah. and we need you guys to decide... Who's right and who's wrong? Yeah. Brandy is going to show us how she's always played on the playground, she says. I didn't play on the playground. I played but my brother Vincent, he's going to explain to us the way that we used to play out on the street. Yeah. Um, we would play, me and Vincent, we didn't eat. If we didn't win, we didn't eat. I mean, you can't, we obviously have been winning a lot we're lately, you can tell. But back in, the, back in the day, that's how we played it. So we're going to show you Brandy's way. Brandy thinks she's right and she thinks she's really good. Well, she actually, what? I'll give her a little prop. She was pretty good the way she was doing it. I was kind of impressed, but I think Vincent's right on this. So you all let us decide what, what, who's right and who's wrong. I would play for Keith the streets. You know what I'm yeah. Play for Keith right. the streets. All right, Brandon. Now let's see your these, your way. These jacks are kind of hard to work with. All right. First, what's the name of the game here? Oh, what yep. are you talking about? Back up. What are we playing here? Jacks. All right. We're playing for Keith. What Move, are you Hayden. For? Hold on. So do you mean just do one? I want time? you. I want you to do it the way you're doing it, and we'll see if they can spot the difference. Okay. All right, impressive. It's one. Oh, look. It's one. oh she's going to drop it. I'm, no, I missed one of them. Oh, she's going to drop it. Oh, you already missed one? So yeah, it's actually it's... Vince's turn. Okay, but you're just doing this for demonstration purposes. Okay. All right, all right so that's how Brandy did it. Now, Vince, let's see your way. All right. First, I always start with a good shake. You know okay, what well, saying? you ain't got to get all crazy about I go, it. Right? That's how I do it. You know, from the street. Back up, back up, back up. I need some room. I need some room. Anyway, the way I thought it was done. Because you bounce it once, grab as many as you can, and grab a ball. Well, okay. see, Brandy okay. said you grab one at a time, and that the That's rules do say round. one at a time okay. for one round. round but okay. the difference is... This is how I do it. Okay. Now, show show us what... That tile was a little uneven there. Now, show us the way Brandy was doing it. Oh, Brandy? I'll show you how Brandy does it. Okay, okay, so the way she was doing it, it's almost like she's getting two bounces, right? Because she's throwing it way up in the air. I know. You act like it's throwing okay. Okay, Brandy. Now do your do it your way, Brandy. With just one? No, try to get all ten of them. No, no, no. Do do it your way. You're bouncing it. Watch out, Hayden. Okay, now do it the way Vincent was doing it. How? He was bouncing. Actually, like no, you throw it down. No, you throw it down. Oh yeah, a little harder, wasn't it? No. Oh, a little harder, wasn't it? No, I don't know. Oh, she is still doing her. Well, I see. Yeah, wow. yeah, okay. Okay, let me do So, this. Vince, explain that real fast, what we're talking about. Oh, I'll be glad to explain that. I don't see that. Just well, how she's throwing it up. I'm not. Bray, if you'll just humble yourself, you might learn something. Ow. All right, now, she's doing it this way. She throws it up, grabs something, then grabs it. Okay, the way we do it in the streets. Hayden. We do it like this. We bounce it, grab it, boom. That seems a little bit harder. Grab it, boom. So her way, she's throwing she's up, grab it, letting it bounce, and then goes up and grab. Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah. Her way, you can, you can almost do a spin. You go. You can't. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm just saying. Now try to do a spin your way. All right. Oh. oh. So it's impossible. <laughs> Give me that ball. So okay, so if we did play with Brandy's rules, here's the thing. I, I actually like Brandy's rules because it's a really easy way to play jacks and, and easy way to win every time. No. Now the way me and my brother do it. It makes it a lot harder to do, and not everyone can do it that way. So I, you guys let us decide down here which way is the right here, way. Here, let me do it. All right, Brandy, let's do it one more time. All right, see how quick you do it, Brandy. You're so good. No, I already did one. All right, do it your way. Here's twos. What no. you say, Brandy? Oh, yeah. I got a hundo. Yeah, illegal gambling. I haven't played this since sixth 
Grace. Oh, we could tell. You probably step all night. Got a hundo clothes. here that says Brandy can't beat me. Yeah. In a game of jacks with my rules. Brandy plays up, stays up all night there's practicing jacks. There's a odd number, so now there's fours. Oh, hold on, let me do that again. Oh, well, she, oh, she messes up, rusty. so let's do it again. Brandy kind of just makes up rules as she goes. Yes, she doesn't. Oh, she doesn't? No. All right, Hayden, let me see you try, Hayden. Hold on, hold on. Let's, let's do see five. Hayden can do it. Let's just do this. Hayden, do it, do it your mom's way. Oh, really? Five? See, that? you can't do five bouncing it and grabbing it. Put, just put five out there. Six. But bounce it, like, put, throw it down and do it. Throw it down. I don't know what you're talking about. Yes. <laughs> I knew it. Isn't that slow mo? That is, is that not, going to slow mo? Okay. That's harder. Just say, is it harder or not? I don't say where we're from, but your town is a little was less it hard? than my town. So oh, that's why she, you would play oh a yeah, less. yeah, a little less. Now she's, she's judging us. That's yeah, so she about. married that's down. That's why you would go. Why would you ever go? So Brandy thinks she married down because I'm from a lesser town than her. Oh. So that's how you learn to play that's why, that's why we always beat them in baseball, football, wrestling, everything. Always. No, I guess not Jacks. Not Jacks. If it was an Olympic sport, though, our team would destroy it. Yes. So Brandy, just admit, the way me and Vince were doing no, it is harder. it means that you don't know how to play Jacks. Was it, was it harder, though, the way we did it? If you just make it like if you... So it was harder. No, but, it's just goofy. Oh, but goofy. I have a question though, Brandy. Like, you if just, everyone agrees to play that way, is it the wrong way? Exactly. All right, let's see Hayden do it. We got to teach Hayden the right way to do it. Which is our way. Like me. Do it like your mom, because that is the easier way for like little kids. It won't do it I need to get it closer. Nice. Two hands. I like oh, it. Wow. I want to see that. Okay, you're getting there, Hayden. You're getting there. Okay, so here's the deal. Brandy's way is easier. Mine Vince's way is Not harder. Easier. Just which way is the right, right way? That's what we want to right. know. Brandy, which one do you think is the right way? Your way, obviously? Yes. Okay. Well, we'll that's up for debate. You guys leave comments down below. I'll Let us know. Okay. Hey, so here's the deal. Uh, my brother Vincent actually got us a housewarming gift, kind of. The th when I say kind of, he brought one over. We're going to go and check it out real fast. Okay, so my brother Vincent actually got us something pretty cool. Uh, Brandy, I was surprised Brandy liked it. Because if I would have got her that, she'd probably be like, oh, I don't like it. But anyone else? Oh, so she loves it. <laughs> he knew my taste. Okay. I know you're Anyways, what is it? what is this? What do we got going on here? Anybody? Randy? What is Hayden? it? Hayden. Show us what it is. What does it do? What is the cool Vanna. feature about it? What? It opens. Oh, that's awesome. The mirror. Holy moly! You can put stuff in there. Necklaces. I like it. Bracelets. I open on both the other sides. Other side. Yeah, we'll have to move it. And you got a little drawer. So what is that, Hayden? What is Joy this box. thing? Jewelry box. That's cool, isn't it? Or hey, what? Guys? Yeah. Go check out his place. Oh, yeah. That's what we're talking about that in just a second. So, Brandon, do you like it? Yes. You know, I got to buy you some jewelry now. So here's the deal. Vincent kind of set me up on this deal. He buys the world's biggest jewelry box, and it's empty. So now I have to spend money to fill it up for all four of these girls that are living with me in this house. Really, Vincent? That's how I roll, bro. <laughs> oh, <laughs> man. Oh, uh, whatever. Hey, Vincent, I'm going to let you talk about this. My brother actually works for um, this company. Uh, you guys sometimes. Sometimes. Yeah. Um, it's kind of weekly. They call, hey, we've got some work for you guys. Come up here and do it. Well, Vincent had worked out a deal um, that he was able to get Brandy and the girls this awesome uh, box here, jewelry box. And all, I, all in return is just talk about this guy's company because he's, he's in Oklahoma. Um, I know i got a lot of Oklahoma subscribers. So if you're in Oklahoma, you guys really need to go check this guy out. Uh, I got some. What? Hi. <laughs> I got some footage. Mitch actually took some footage of the place. Uh, I'll put the, I'll put that towards the end of the video. If you guys are interested in that, you can check that out. I'm gonna let Vincent talk about the guy just real quick because he's already done a little intro for it and all that. So I'll play at the end. Of the, I need the clip. to see my bun. Oh, that's a good bun. All right. All right, guys. Hey, how's it going? Like uh, my brother said, I go and work for this guy sometimes. Uh, Reverend Todd Sloggett. It's a great guy. Great family. Uh, this place is called The Saving Place. They sell rustic furniture, and they've got mattresses. Uh, they've got everything, really. They, they've, got, they've got couches. They've got, they've got everything you can do and you need to fill your whole home, and it's all really cool stuff just like this, just rustic and awesome. Yeah, I like know. it. Hey, one real quick. One real, of a kind. One of a kind? Yeah. It is one of a kind. Real quick, what's that hat you got on? Oh, this hat right here? I made this hat. This is the uh, Reckless Saints of Nowhere. Yeah, website they can check out. I do. www.recklesssaintsofnowhere.com. Check right. it out. Check it out. All right. But I'm going to play the footage that Vincent took 
um, of the place. You got some footage of all their stuff, I guess. Absolutely. So if you guys want to see that, stick around and uh, go check him out if that's something you're interested in. Thanks for watching. Hey, this is Todd Sloggett from The Saving Place, rustic furniture and mattress store in downtown Sepulpa, Oklahoma. We actually have the deepest line of rustic furniture in the entire state. Great prices, all kinds of product. We're actually controlled by a mission group. We're generating money for to help the homeless and drug addicts and, and uh, different ministry groups all the time. And uh, we, we carry real wood, solid wood, cheaper than most of the modern veneers you can get your hands on. Uh, it's, it's western, it's country, it's farm, it's cowboy. That's kind of our specialty. And as you look around and see some of the product, you'll see we've got, got some real leather. We've got some real Brazilian Longhorn cowhide, and uh, you can see us at 619 East Dewey Avenue, downtown Sepulpa, Oklahoma. Call us at 918-227-4673, or visit our website, thesavingplace.net. Check us out.